Welcome, it's six o'clock. It is unbelievably the 4th of January 2021. I know like you, you're hoping this is going to be a much better year, a different year to the year 2020. I'm not quite sure it started out that way. So wherever you are, whatever tiers you're in, everyone is welcome. Those that have been with us from the beginning, this I believe is number 60. Now starting back in March, we're now up to session number 60. I know people are picking this up at different times, at different places, wherever you are in the world, welcome. If this is your first Team Thief circuit, keep it nice and controlled. I don't know why, but at the moment I've decided let's go big. Let's start the year with a big bang. Let's start how we mean to go on. A little bit, lesser, a little bit better in terms of lighting today. I've stolen my good wife's uh, lighting for uh, the backdrop, so I'm a little bit more in HD hopefully today. You can see a bit clearer, or that could just be a bad thing. Right. Let's get started. Three sets. So remember, if you're new to this, maybe only do two sets. Take your time. We are 30 seconds on, five seconds of recovery. We've got a good 18 exercises to work through. We're going to be doing some of them twice. We're doing left and right sides. It is going to be a tough circuit, 35-minute circuit. So less of me talking, more of us doing. But remember, do it in your own time, your own ability. Push when you want to push. Lie on the couch when you want to lie on the couch. It is really up to you. Let's start, though, with some press-ups. We're starting with press-ups. 30 seconds, five-second rest. Rest is not the name of the game today. We're going in three, two, one. Let's go. 30 seconds of press-ups. So I hope everyone had a, uh, a good New Year or a quiet New Year's Eve. And uh, whatever people were doing, I'm sure it wasn't that exciting given the uh, different restrictions everyone was on. So... Uh, I think uh, I don't think we'll ever have a New Year's Eve quite like that. Or I hope we never have a New Year's Eve quite like that. So uh, it was uh, a bit strange, a bit quiet, but given what we had in uh, 2020, it was expected. Now, back raises are next so on your front. So we're going skydivers, back raises, one, two, and down. Let's go right side and down, left side and down, all fours and down. Right side and down. Let's go opposites. Left and right. Good work. Let's go opposites. Other left and right. Good work. Let's go just legs. Let's go just arms. Let's go opposites again. Let's go all fours. And all fours. Back raises. Step ups are next. So onto your platform. Nice controlled step up. And as promised last week, I said... I threatened to do it, not that it's a threat to anyone but myself, that I would run a marathon on New Year's Eve. And you might have seen on Strava, you might have seen on uh, my posts, I came good with my, my word and I ran the 26.2 miles solo up and down a couple of, uh, I won't call them mountains, more like hills, but uh, yeah, it was a tough one. But I got it done, personal best by three minutes. Step ups, go to sit ups. Let's go into sit-ups. Nice controlled sit-ups to start. Fire that core. So uh, that was my New Year's Eve punishment, celebration, whatever way you want to look at it. But seeing off the year 2020, when I was actually really surprised that I recovered quite quickly from it. So I definitely think my uh, sock and endorphin pros out that. Good bit of recovery, SOS, ER recovery drink. That's sit up. Lunges are next. So we're going into lunges. So Mick Hill's in the house. Welcome back, Mick. You ran a fantastic uh, 31 20 and a few seconds before Christmas in the Masters 45 section. So great running, Mick. And uh, welcome back to the Team T Circuit uh, house tradition, whatever you want to call it. I know many of you are picking this up at different times. So not everyone does it live on a Monday, but we've got. Ridiculously good numbers. So uh, that's probably more a state of the nation right now. Good work. That's lunges. Hip raises are next. Being that no one can go out. We're going to go both sides of hip raises. So 30 seconds of dry food. So isolate the hip. Lift it up and just hold it for a split second. So again, if you're new to these exercises, I'll try to explain a bit better than we've already have done so far. Kind of cranking on with the news. So just isolating that. I've put something on my platform just to uh, protect my Achilles. Protect my calf when I'm pushing through. Just holding that, but you're trying to isolate that hip. 
push you through, hold it for a split second, and then back down again. And we're going to do the other side. Yes. Taking five seconds, kick back. Think of the summer. And up. Oh. Good work. And I know many of you should have gone away at different times over the holidays. Abroad, some of you should be away now, I know. So it is a rotten time. So uh, in terms of travel, in terms of seeing different people. So uh, we normally are quite busy over Christmas with races and seeing family and friends. None of that. Absolutely none of that. So and I know for many, let's try for that here. This is going to be a tough period now. Good yeah. work. Hit races. Dips are next. Being that Christmas is over, decorations are gone in the, uh, the loft today. So it's not going to be an easy few months, especially with unknown about schools, universities, people's work, any type of sport. Where are we going to get Park Run back? Oh, I think uh, Park Run, we know when we got a bit of normality back is when Park Run's back. So just isolate this, shoulders into the triceps and back of your arms. So just keep it nice and controlled. Everything's about rhythm. Everything's keeping it in a nice controlled motion. Good work. Well done, the Andrews. So that's dips. All fours are next. So opposites. So just going opposites and hold and back again. Opposites and hold. Good work, Phil. Really appreciate that message from our, our last session. So uh, good to know different people are doing the circuit in different locations. So thanks for that message. And uh, fantastic work. Different people are doing it different places. So uh, thanks again, Lee. Lovely little message. Lee Trevor. So uh, really, really grateful to hearing uh, so many positive yeah. stories out there. The circuits are helping. Squats are next. Single leg squats. So isolate that. And then just going down. So isolate that one leg. Don't need to go too far down. Just a slight bend of the knee. You'll get enough of a, a workout in that quad. So your big engine at the front of your leg. That uh, does so much of the work when you're running. And you know when it gets tired. But you want your hamstring at the back and your quad to work in equal proportions. You want them to be equally pushing, pulling you, stabilizing you. So making sure that you uh, take off that impact that goes through your knee. So here we go. So into set number two of our squats. So isolating. So we're going left and right side for the 30 seconds. So we're going to go this to crunchies. So nothing too fancy tonight. I thought uh, let's go big in terms of the, uh, the duration, but in terms of the exercises, let's keep them uh, fairly routine, fairly safe. So uh, it's just about a good, for those that do the three sets, it's a good 35-minute workout today. Yeah. So in to crunches. Crunches are next. So fire that core and then just extending out, coming back. Good work. There you go. Off on to another exercise. This is number 10. So we're over halfway through the set. So we're going to go 30 seconds of the first set, 25 on the second set, 20 seconds of the last set. So it will get a little bit easier as we get a little bit more fatigued. So this is the big first set. So really good work, everyone. Well done. Hold that. Hamstring bridges are next. Good work. So we're going to go on our backs. Hamstring bridges. So similar to the hip raises. So just pushing through. So just extending that. Remember, we've done a bit of quad work already. So this is just equalizing things up. So just strengthening that hamstring. So uh, my recovery's gone. So well, I even got my mini heel, my mini heels out. Same go as well. So the legs have done pretty well recovery-wise. Much better than I thought they would run a marathon. But uh, I took some good uh, fuel on board. Good work. I think one of the other things was because of uh, let's go left side because of the travel restrictions in tears. Why I did the marathon was a six-mile cycle away, so I could have driven there. But I, I stuck to the COVID rules. So you have to start your exercise from your house. So I started on a bike, locked my bike up six miles in, ran the 26 miles or 26.2 miles, and then cycled the six miles back. Now, that wasn't a fun cycle back. But I tell you what, I think it helped my legs. It helped my body recover. I actually did a cool down. Keep extending through. Good work. Planks next. Whereas, I tell you what, if I'd have run the marathon with the car there, into plank. I don't think I would have done any cool down. No, I wouldn't have done any cool down. So uh, maybe there's a lesson there. Maybe there's a a, 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 mot- 
a good motto to that story that, uh, that when you run a marathon, ride six miles home or ride six miles on a bike, it could save your legs. So, uh, but you uh, often find things out through luck. I'm sure if I did it again, it wouldn't make any difference. So uh, I threatened to go back to Snowden. I need to do Snowden Marathon again. I'm not sure I'm going to run, uh, do six miles biking after that. Plank, running arms, let's go. Into running arms. So one of our favourite, Lisa, your running arms, flying down that 5K home straight. Good work in your virtual NOS Garland. Well done those that did the NOS Garland 5K. Those that know, I love NOS Garland. Lucky enough to win it four times. But, uh, almost definitely lucky to coach some brilliant athletes to win it, but, but also to commentate on it for a number of years with a good friend Chris Moss so gutted to not be in Mountain Ash good work that's running arms twisted ups so those that have done it before let's go opposites elbow opposite elbow if you haven't done Nos Gullen yet put it on your bucket list remember going to Valencia next year as a group we can come back and then do Nos Gullen so we can uh, go and run some 5k PBs on New Year's Eve then everyone can hug and drink and, and uh, see each other on New Year's Eve. That's the aim. 2021. It's going to be the best New Year's and Christmas ever, we hope. So, good circuits at the moment. Good twist sit-ups. There you go. Another core down. Mini jumps are next. Light on our feet. So, jumping around different directions. I've got my tri-zone socks on. So, uh, Garrett and the tri-zone team join us on our Wednesday night running group so again when we do start back up with that so i know nikki's out there i know some of the guys some of our running group are out there charlie so uh can't wait to see you guys back when we do get a chance to get back so uh it'll be uh, good fun to have our wednesday night running groups so all the way around different directions light on your feet good work so that's mini jumps mini jumps go to leg extension so same arm same leg balancing down and balancing up. So just going one side. So balancing up. So just trying to stabilize that. I was good at this last week. This was my best exercise last week. Maybe the marathon fatigues you, uh, your hips. I'm sure it does. It's got to fatigue something. And uh, I think uh, it's an event. I'll tell you what it did make me appreciate. Those that did the beast challenge. So that challenge where some did it in October, some did it in November, where they ran a mile every uh, day of the calendar all the way up to the end of the month. Now, when I ran my marathon, I couldn't imagine the next day running 27 miles. And I certainly couldn't imagine running 25 miles the day before. So Lee, one of my really good neighbours, did it. Garen did it as well. So uh, I don't know how people got the energy to do that. Um, bodies must have been in bits because uh, the sheer thought of doing that. I, uh, I rested the next day and did a biking session the day after that. So zero miles. So remember, keeping this controlled, this is bit better by me. Good balance. Yes. Good work. Leg extensions. Burpees in next. From burpees, Rach, let's yes. go. It's not Lanzarote. It's burpees. Come on, let's go. So keep in control. Burpees, the penultimate exercise of the set. We're going to finish with a couple of side planks to finish off the first set. Remember, this is our 30-second set. We're going to get one set of rest in between. And then we're going to go again. Let's go. Last bit, keeping it control. Three, two, one more. Good work. Side plank. Three, two, one, and up. So, and uh, keep it nice and controlled. This is the end of the first set. 30 seconds in the bag. The catchphrase, yes, done and dusted the first set. <laughs> so keep it nice and strong, nice and controlled. Just want to keep that head in line. I'm watching myself on the screen thinking I am dropping down a bit. So uh, do as I say, not as I do. So we've got one more for the end of this set. I think that should feel a good bit of fatigue across there. Three, two, one. And other side. Whew. 30 seconds and we're up. There you go. Good work. Oh. Catch yourself on the mat there. So 30 seconds. We get one set of recovery. So you get yourself a drink in between. Catch your breath in between, and then we're back. 25 seconds on, five seconds recovery. So it's going to be a recovery stays the same, duration decreases. So remember, if you should first team circuit, if you haven't done too many circuits recently, 
two sets. Brilliant, well done. Yeah. Two sets will be enough. Now that's the first set down. So the beeps will still beep. Get yourself a drink yeah. on board. So the 30 seconds, you get 30 seconds extra recovery on this one. Or five seconds extra recovery if you uh, think about the second set. So 25 seconds on now. Five seconds recovery. This is the second set. So remember, we're starting press-ups. Five seconds recovery again. So fantastic numbers see on the screen. Absolutely brilliant numbers. So take your time. Get yourselves ready. Bit of a stretch across the arms. Stretch across the arms. We've got five seconds recovery. Rest. And then we're in. Second set. Starting in three, two, one. And we're off. Let's go. Press-ups. The timings have worked. Bang on. So press-ups to start. 25 seconds. The second set of our first session of 2021. So session number 60. Come on, good work. Really good. Well done, Michael Davis. Smashing it, Gareth Morgan. Come on, all the way. Last bit. Good work. Well done, Steve Mitchell's crew. Don't forget, we're into back raises. You stay where we are. Back raises. One, two, and down. Right side, and down. Let's go. Rob Lancaster, and left side, and down. All fours, and down, just arms. Good, good, Steve O'Morris. Legs, good work. Right side, good work. Left side, good work. All fours, and all fours again. Superb work. Step ups are next. So, control the step ups. Boom, up. Driving up. So, driving up where you can. So, drive up. And just stabilize. Think about everything going in that linear motion. Nothing too much from side to side. So opposite arm, opposite leg. Drive up. Big engines in your legs. And one more. Good work. Sit up to next. 25 second sit ups. So just don't go, you don't need to go crazy in terms of lifting your hips off, lifting your legs off the ground. Hands on your chest. So you, all of it's through the core. All of it's a kind of a cumulative fatigue now. So if we go through the circuit, still got 19 minutes on the circuit clock to go. So I can see that. You probably can't see that. Right. So we've still got a long way to go. Lunge is the next. Opposite. Right. So uh, and those that do follow me on social media, you know that uh, I made my uh, TV acting debut, if you can call it that. So helping my good wife out in the summer when uh, they were looking for acting bubbles. So uh, not knowing that I'd get a call up, but I was a casualty patient on the casualty Christmas special that was aired uh, a couple of nights ago. So uh, you may or may not see me, but we didn't see me. Hit raise here next. Let's go driving up. Split second, there I was. But fascinating to see the in, ins and outs of... Uh, how they do things in the BBC, how they do things with the uh, casualty filming. So, uh, and I was uh, a COVID patient lying down on a ventilator, so it played it to perfection. So the phone has not stopped ringing. So I'm expecting that a call from Hollywood any moment. Good work, left side. So I do know that they're looking for a new bond. So uh, that Great. could be the next step. No, jokes aside, bit of fun helping out uh, my wife who worked. Uh, as the uh, body double for uh, Doctor Who. So I'm uh, not the most famous actor in the house by any means. So driving with the hips. We've got second of our hip raises going to dips next. Dips are next. Good work. So keeping it nice and strong. Keeping it nice and focused. So dips are next. So wherever you are, I know we've got lots of those doing it internationally as well. So welcome, whether you're Canada, USA, Spain, the rest of Europe, you're always welcome. So Mo in Saudi Arabia, smashing the circuits out. So dips, 25 seconds. You're going to see a breeze in comparison to 30 seconds. Good work. There you go. Fast arms. Let's go. Let's go. Come on the Cornish crew. Come on the Hercules Wimbledon crew. Good work. Dips to all fours. All fours are next. Let's go, Phil. Fantastic work. Good work. Come on, Keith. So smashing it through. Let's go, Charlie. So good work. Keep that core nice and locked in. Well done, Sam. Well done, Samantha. Superb work, Alex. Come on. 
Getting it done. Well done, Louis. Good work. Come on. That's it. Nice and controlled. Good work, Henry. Rest. Good work. That's all fours. All fours go to squats. So remember, I say that one leg. So keep an eye if you've got something in front of you. So just think about that knee. Just going straight, Liz. That's it. Good work. There we go. Let's go, Gemma. Let's go, Kate. Great work, Tony. So just keep it nice and controlled. There we go. Superb work. Superb. There you go. So just dipping down and back up. There you go. And that's one set down. Other leg. Swap them around. Good. And in my training group out there, stay nice and focused. Let's make sure we have a really good month in January. So when the, the races do really open up, we are absolutely flying. So that's what you need to be right now, as patient and as focused as if uh, the races are just around the corner, which they will be at some point. So we're just staying patient, staying focused. Good work. Squats go to crunchies. Crunchies are next. Good. Let's go, crunchies. Come on, the junior athletes out there, the Harmons, the Pecs, the Smalls, come on. So don't let this, this period right now, this is where you can make your gains. This is where those in your age group, they're not doing things like this tonight, and you're going to get massive gains, massive benefits. Good work, Finn. Great work. That's what we want right now. Those that stay focused, they're going to make Great. massive gains. So well done. Crunchies go to Hampshire Bridges. So isolate that hamstring. So you've got to adapt around what you've got, whether it's lack of tracks, whether it's lack of weights. Just need to adapt around what can you find that's the equivalent. What can you do that's the equivalent? No races. Can you time trial? Can you find some loops? Find some things to uh, simulate similar things ready for the big return, which will come. There we go. Just need to be a bit more patient than we thought we might about a month ago when uh, things were looking a lot more rosy. But let's isolate. Let's get these hamstrings nice and strong. So many people get different issues with hamstrings. Often that's down to lower backs. So often you know, we're really focusing on both in these sessions and also making sure that everything works as equally as strong. Good work. That's how hamstring bridge is done. Planks next. Into a good strong plank. Let's go. Up, plank, and just hold that. You can if you want. Lift up one leg, Beth. You can do that. Easy. Good work. We've got uh, Mikey Brannigan out in the US. So I said this previous. Mikey Brannigan, Steve Morris, two of the best Paralympic athletes in the world, probably uh, doing circuits in tandem right now. So that's great. Great to hear. Great to see. Good work, Sonia. Good work. That's our practice. Planks in the back, over halfway, running arms. Come on, fast running arms. Let's go. Fast arms, fast arms. That's it. Drive those arms, drive those arms. Good work. So keep fast arms, fast arms. All the way, all the way. Come on, faster, faster, faster. Keep driving up and down. Come on, the masters athletes out there. Show the juniors how it's done. Come on, if you like leaning your legs with your arms when you do run, use them even more. Come on. Good work, running arms. We're going to go twist sit-ups and next. Twist sit-ups. Let's go. Up. Twist. Back. Up. Let's go. Let's go. Good work, Gareth. Smashing through with this. Come on. 15 seconds in. Or oh, 15 seconds to go. Sorry. 10 seconds in. Now we're 15 seconds in. Come on. Fast. But control. Tap the elbow with the, the elbow. The knee with the elbow. Oh. Maybe I'm running out of gas now. Twist it up. Go to mini jumps. Light them up, feet. Come on. Come on. We're getting through this second set. Just 20 seconds in that last set. We're going to be flying through that. Light on your feet. I've always said this like a boxer. So imagine yourself with a skipping rope. Different directions. All the way around. Come on, ADY. Come on, Adam Davis. Really good work. To the left. Back. To the middle. All the way around. And all the way around the other way. Superb work, well done. That's mini jumps go to leg extensions next. So this is about balance and it's about core and it's about ankle strength. It's about hip strength. Looks easy. So can do this as a really good warm-up exercise. Can do it with a, a dumbbell or 
even something just a you know, milk bottle filled with water. So just that adds a bit more extension to the core. So just staying nice and strong through that core. And again, running is just a series of balancing exercises. So uh, if you can isolate it and make yourself slightly stronger than uh, every foot strike, if you're a little bit more balanced, a little bit more uh, stable, then you're going to run faster. If you only have to look at people at the end of a race when uh, things start to fall apart, and often that's a little bit earlier than it should do as well. So if you can isolate and get a bit stronger through this whole chain here, right. you're going to be better and healthier. So... Burpees are next, let's go. Burpees are side packs. We've smashed through this middle set. Good work. Jumping in to 2021 in a positive way. Come on, 25 seconds of burpees. First session of 2021. We're off and burpeeing. If that is the same. Come on, let's go. Boom. Again, up. Down. Up. One more. Good Great. work. That's burpees. Side planks next. 25 seconds each side of side plank. Good. Get 25 seconds recovery then. Catch your drink, catch your breath. And then we've got the final set. We're going to smash out 20 seconds on five seconds recovery. It's a 35 minute session, one of our biggest today. And so let's start how we mean to go on in 2021. So no letting up. Let's take our frustrations out. Not on ourselves, but let's make ourselves fitter. Good work. Rest. In a positive way, not a destructive way and up nice and strong plumb line all the way down nice and strong can lift up your leg if you want to make it a bit harder just to challenge yourself good work smashing through that well done this is set two done and dusted catch a drink after 25 seconds of recovery and then we're back on last set 20s on fives off all the way through three two one boom that's it two sets down Catch a drink, catch your recovery. Fantastic work, everyone. Uh, I tell you what, unbelievable numbers. We've not lost anyone tonight. Brilliant. Mm. But as I said, if two sets is enough, dip out. Nothing wrong with that. Go and do a cool down, static stretching, holding the stretching. That's absolutely great. If you're with, with us for the last set, let's go. Keep it control, keep it focused. 20 seconds on, five seconds of recovery. Same exercises, same again. Five seconds. We're in. Press ups to start. You know that. Boom. Let's go. 20 seconds of press ups. Keep breathing in between. Keep it as aerobic as you can, even though some of them are explosive. You need to get as much air on board. So in between, we recover. Come on. When you mark up where's crew out there, smash it. Good work. Back raise the next. Good. And let's go right side. Good. Left side. Good. Opposites. That's it. Opposites. Let's go. Just arms. Just legs. And let's go. All fours again. Let's go. Right side. Left side. Good work. Step up to the next. Come on. Smash you through this. Drive up. Opposites. We're talking about Mark Hookway. Great book. Read the first of the Tunbridge. Tunbridge are coming. Great book if you're ever interested in how a junior team becomes a senior team, but everything in between team management to uh, coaching your own son. Right. A really fascinating read. Sit up to next. Right. Our very own uh, Charlie Justin Allen appeared on page 70. So, uh, but uh, so many of the names, the junior athletes that came in as under 13s, still in it, seniors. So I think that's testament to the work that uh, Mark and the whole coaching and team have done at Tombridge. So uh, but it's, a, right. it's a fascinating read. Lunge is the next. So, uh, right. It makes me appreciate not, uh, not looking after too many of the junior age group. So even though I do love my junior age group, uh, athletes uh, do a great job. But uh, yeah, I think it's a funny old uh, business with so many ups and downs. And uh, for those that have made it to senior level, as I said, absolutely great to see. That's nice. Hit raise it next. As, uh, well, that is testament, as I said, to them as a club, making sure that they have a base to bring them through. So yeah, definitely a read. I've still got the second 
version to go. So uh, that will be even more bedtime reading. So hip raises, extending through. So good work. Raising through. Good work. That's right. our first hips. Second hips. Let's go. Right. Drive through. Good work. Nicely done. Nicely done. Driving through. Good work. Keep nice and focused, nice and controlled. There you go. Keeping it nice and strong. I know we're working hard because the windows are steaming up in there. So uh, the neighbors will be wondering what on earth is going on. Good work. Yes. That's our hip raises. Dips and X. Into dips. Let's go. Good. Driving up. Come on. Good work. Keep it nice and strong. Nice and focused. That's it. Smashing through it. Come on, everyone. On this uh, cold uh, bit in between the uh, after Christmas of what's going on. We've got Boris on our eight. Let's find out what's going on in the yeah. end. That's our dips done. All fours are next. What is going on? Yeah. Let's go. Scotland are in a lockdown as of tomorrow. So if anyone is out in Scotland, so uh, we hope you guys are okay. So uh, let's go. Opposites each side. Opposites. Nice and strong. That's it. Don't rotate the hips. Keeping it nice and strong. Fantastic work. Squats are next. Single leg squats. Flying home. We're in the home straight now. I thought this uh, last set would go quickly. It is going quickly. We're on exercise nine of 18 already. So we're uh, smashing through it. Come on. Really good work. Well done, Nick. Well done, Michael. Boom. Nicely done. That's one down. Swap it around. Other leg. Be equally as strong. That's it. Good work. Drive through. Nice and strong. That's it. On your way. Let's get the second of these uh, squats in the bag. Good work. Last bit. Four seconds. Three seconds. Oh, two seconds. That's my balance then. Squats go to crunches are next. Crunches to Hampshire Bridges. Let's go. Keep breathing, keep getting the air on board. Good work. Come on, Ifan, really good. Come on, Alan, fantastic work. Come on, wherever you are, smashing the circuit out. Any of the running punks out there? Come on, getting strong. Well done, that's Crunchy's. Crunchy's got a Hampshire Bridges. You should feel the fatigue now. This should be the last bit. So remember, if we are going to get those part run PBs, those. 10K PBs, there's marathon, half marathon PBs, there's trap PBs. This is where it kicks in now. Bit of fatigue. Body starts to shout at you. And you need to shout yes. back at it. Hold your form, keeping it nice and focused. There we go. Good. There you go. Keeping it in control. Good work. Till the end. That's it. Drive through. Keeping your hips. You make your hips. Imagine the glass of water on them or something where you just don't want to tip it from side to side. You want to keep it in one place. Good work. Well Great. done. That was uh, how she produce to Plank is next. Plank. Good. Let's go into Plank. Superb. Lift up one leg if you want. Good work, down. One leg. Good work, Tom. Nicely done. Lift up one leg. Smashing it. Well done, Rob. Good work. Other. Good work, Craig. Come on. All the way. Last little bit, three, two, one. Good work, that was plank. Plank goes to running arms. Let's go. Good work, fantastic, smashing this out. Come on, as I said, juniors, masters, whoever you are, seniors, doesn't matter. It's all relative, come on, last bit, nice and positive start. Good workout to kick off our circuits of 2021. And that's running arms done, twist it ups. Remember what's coming next. We're into the last three minutes of the workout. That last 60 minutes has flown by. Come on, last bit. Twist up, down. Twist up, down. Come on. Twist, tap, go. Twist, tap, go. Good work. Five seconds. Four seconds. Three seconds. Two seconds. Whew. Twist sit ups goes to mini jumps. Come on, light on the feet, different directions. Back, left, good work, all the way around. Back, 
Good work. In and out, in and out, back and forth. Left, let's go. Crisscross, crisscross. There we go. Light on our feet. Yes, well done. Superb work. Mini jumps goes to leg extensions. Same arm, same leg. Down and up. Same leg, that's it. Good work. Home straight. Good, nice focus exercises to finish off. Superb work. That's it. Nice and controlled. Last bit. Boom. Smash that. Other side. So balance. And let's go a little bit early. But that's okay. You know, it should cut the seconds. A bit more strength on this side. Good work. That's it. Feel that core. You can feel it kicking in each time. Balance with the ankle as well. Good proprioception work. So anyone that's rolled an ankle before, really good work. As I said, you can uh, make it harder. It's a good warm-up exercise. Rest. Burpees are next. Let's finish off. Burpees. Let's get one, one, two, and up. Good. One, two, and up. That's it. Come on. Come on, any of the uni students out there. Come on. Frustration out on this. Bit of height off the ground. Driving off the ground. Come on. Bit of height. Bit of speed. Good work. Superb work. Well done. Side planks. Three, two, one. Work. Boom, that's it. Nice and strong. Lift up that leg if you want. Hand back again. Good work. Nice and controlled. Finish off. Nice and strong. We have nailed our first session of 2021. Thanks so much, everyone, for the great support through last year. 59 circuits on March until uh, the yeah. end of the year. This is number 60. And this is our first of the yeah. year. We're here to stay at the moment. We're not going anywhere. And no one's going many places anyway. So we are back next week. So that will be session number 61. That will be, I think, the 11th of January by then. So uh, pretty sure it is. So make sure some good static stretching. Make sure you hydrate after this. There yeah. we go. If you've got the ability to cool down, go and do that in terms of if it's anything spinning on a bike. Anything you can just catch your, uh, bring your heart rate down. Unbelievable numbers. 35 minute session, three sets, 30 seconds on, five seconds recovery, 25 seconds on, five seconds recovery, 20 seconds on, five seconds recovery. Superb work. You've absolutely smashed it. Well done, Jack, out there. Fantastic work. Great starts of the year, everybody. Superbly positive. Wherever you are, whatever your goals are, we are back here every Monday, six o'clock. If you're picking this up on playback, Fantastic work. That is our biggest session. So that's our biggest ever circuit session. One of our best turnouts as well. That's less than me talking. Go and hydrate. See everyone next week. Circuit session, as it says on the towel, given to you by Andrew Dean Young. Done and dusted. Well done, Marshall. You absolutely smashed it as well. Guys, Mick, everyone there, take care. Monday, 6 o'clock, Team 3 circuit number 61. We're back next week. Well done, everyone. You absolutely smashed it.